What's the difference between men and women? That's a joke. No, serious. Never met a woman who knew how to turn off a light. Born thinking the switch only goes one way, on. You know, they're stripped blind, sick in the living room. I mean, every woman I ever let have a key, I swear to God. It's like, come home, house all lit up. <laughs> and my job, you see, apparently, because, because my chromosomes happen to be different, is I then gotta walk through that house, turn off every single light this chick left on. Is that right? Yeah, baby. Mm. Oh, Reverend Shane's are preaching to you now, boy. <laughs> then the same chick, mind you, she'll bitch about a, a global warming. See, see, this is this is when Reverend Shane wants to quote from the God Gospel and say, um, "Darling, maybe you and every other pair of boobs on this planet just figure out that the light switch see it goes both ways. Maybe we wouldn't have so much global warming." You, know, you say that. Mm. Anyway, uh, polite version. <laughs> Still, man, that that earns me this this look of loathing you would not believe. And that's when the exorcist voice pops out. You sound just like my damn father. <clears throat> always, always yelling about the power bill, telling me to turn off the damn lights. And what do you say to that? I know what I want to say. I want to say, bitch, you mean to tell me you've been hearing this your entire life? You are still too damn stupid to learn how to turn off a switch. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I don't actually say that though. You know. That would be bad. All right, all right. Yeah, mm. I go with the uh, go with the polite version there too. Very so. wise, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well. So how's it with Lori, man? She's good. She's good at turning off lights. Right. Really good. Mm. I don't know when he sometimes forgets. I don't know what I meant. We didn't have a great night. Hey, look, man, I may have uh, failed to amuse with my sermon, but I did try. The least he could do is, is speak. That's, that's what she always says. <laughs> speak. Speak. You'd think I was the most closed-mouthed son of a bitch you ever hear her tell it. Do you express your thoughts? Do you share your feelings, that kind of stuff? Thing is, lately, whenever I try, everything I say makes her impatient, like she didn't want to hear it after all. It's like she's pissed at me all the time, and I don't know why. Look, man, that's just shit couples go through. You know, it's a, it's a phase. Last thing she said this morning? Yeah. Sometimes I wonder if you even care about us at all. She said that in front of our kid. Imagine going to school with that in your head. The difference between men and women? I would never say something that cruel to her. Certainly not in front of Carl.